Mm. So, uh, we were like, <laughs> you were still saying that we are the same age group. Yeah, and then like, but then um, you, 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 you also different and unique, you know, in, in your own way, and and not just unique, but also authentic, because like. When I, I know that stigma that there is on us, and then like yet you choosing to spend time with us, where else you could have been, you know, out there spending time with other people that are just like you. But then the fact that you are separating yourself and you're giving yourself time for, for for us, you know, so that we can have a voice and maybe people can learn and learn to understand and not just understand alone, but then also, um, you know, acknowledge. The, the 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 trauma that we go through each and every day that the life that we go through it's not a choice one time because I'm sure I'm not to add to harm for the other or any child I look school and I'm great one I think I told him that when I grow up I want to be a drug addict you know what I'm saying so it's something very emotional and deep as well so. I'm really thankful for your time, and and, and, and you know, I, I pray that the change will really come through. It will really come through for not just for me, but for the whole entire world. Because you know, this thing it's also a a a, 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 a pandemic. <laughs> That's what they call it, right? Is it right? Yeah, mm, I always wanted mm, to use mm, that word mm, in the sentence. Mm. Anyway. It's also like a pandemic that it is that we we are facing as as this nation, you know, as this youth. And the sad part is that we are the youth of this country, and we are, you know, the mothers and the fathers of other children as well, and we are the leaders of this country. So, you know, my sister, I give you big ups. Like you, you brave. I'm sorry, you brave. Like you brave. Like in the pain, we have a heart, and and then it shows me humility. Because being humble is having a heart for another human being, and that's what you have right now. And you know, let me do my goalhoodies, a goalhoodies, and you know, just expand and go big. Thank you. Yeah, so you can start. Oh, it's okay. Uh, I was bred in Basel when I'm a mommy lord. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, my my mother and father never naga strata says one. So mm. like I grew up when I or like go go quaga, how mama gala mm. papa gets strata says one. It's just like six houses apart. Mm. So yeah, I came okay when it's a whole namo. And then I, I, I grew up like a normal childhood. Mm. Yeah, like my mom was present in Mupilumba, Galapapaga as well. But then um, when I was in grade four, then they got divorced. And then once they got divorced, we got, you know, they they first separated and then they had to go through that divorce. Um, season way there's court you know having going to court uh, up and down and stuff and then you know it came to a point where like I felt like they had to make me choose who do I choose between my mom and my dad well, when, and so automatically so I'd go for my mom and then like my mom is she 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 was a carrier actually you know like because you know mothers have so she she carried she, she carried my brother and I, you know, throughout. Even still today, she's still carrying me, you know, as I'm still an addict. But she's still in my life and you know I appreciate her as, as well and then and I pray that one day let me get on you know, I'll make her proud to be the daughter that she has raised me to because I can own really good things, you know, she's a Christian woman. She loves God. She prays every day. She goes to church every Sunday. And then, Lena, I can take so, you know, I do pray with her because like, she makes it a, a tradition. It's like, it's a tradition. Like, every morning, her 
we must pray. After praying, we have to read a scripture from the Bible. And then from there, we can depart. And then later on in the evening, after you know, pray before we go to sleep. And then, so, yeah, I, I basically grew up in a Christian background you know, from my mom. And she's still instilling that inside of me. And 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 I'm I'm trying to practice it, you know, by doing good deeds, even though I walk through the valleys. You know, even though I walk through the shadow of the valleys of the darkness and and, and fear and, and, and anger and deceit and you know and cheating and stuff. Like even though I'm trapped in that world but I believe that I'm a Christian as well. It's important to believe in something yeah. bigger than you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I respect you for that. Yeah. It keeps yes. you grounded. Yeah, it does, it does, it does. I want to say and it gives you hope and... Yeah, yeah it does, it does, it does. True. And where's your dad? My dad passed on God 2010. I'm sorry. Yeah, he passed on God 2010. And then, like, um, when he passed on, you know, um, okay, that's when I started rebelling, <laughs> really, yeah, that's when um, I started smoking drugs, you know, going out with men and stuff like that, because um, my dad was a man that he was, okay, he was like a typical South African man, Wabereka, you know, he takes care of his family if he wants to, you know, like, but then he wasn't, like, consistent on it, but then, like, if he wants to, but then, like, if he needs him to be there, and then, like, you put your foot down, he will be there, but then, like, hoga, hoga, say, we look at how, like, hey, papa, we look at how, so, and then, go, and go, go, and 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 so, yeah, like, um, I felt like a little daddy's girl because yeah, I gave it, they, my parents got divorced. Mm. And so, like, my mom is a strong Christian woman. Mm. Like, she doesn't, she doesn't compromise, mm. you know. She doesn't drink, she doesn't smoke. She has never, like, and I have bought her from my childhood. I'm sorry, like, she, you know, she's never smoked. She's never done, like, the various things that I'm doing. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And then, because then, like, I'm not my mother full time all the time. After I figure out, I'm still to go, I think I even go to go high and things. So, when I'm not going to go to the house, I just threw in the towel. I was like, ah, oh, you know, it doesn't matter now. It doesn't matter anything. I'm just going to see what's going to happen. And then, you know, I started getting involved, meeting the wrong friends, you know. Um, Hanging out with the wrong guys, you know, and sometimes we do jola. I do jola a lot, like in tongue, you know, in tongue because like, you know, everyone, you're like your first love will hit you deep, like once you break up, whatever. So after I broke up with this guy that I thought I was gonna. Like, how long? How were you guys dating? Yo, we dated for like six years. Okay. Yeah, we dated for six years. So like that, I thought you know, it was going to be this perfect little family that I'm going to create and stuff and of him. But Kanakweo, you know, he was um, five years older than me. So like you can imagine, eh, like he was five years older and then Gamo, you know, he's like, you know, wild. <laughs> and I was like this sweet little girl. So, mm -hmm. um, you know, like I was in denial. Well, when I that he wasn't for me. That you know, when I took pleasure doing drugs because I guess like on the Zuba, I felt at ease. Like okay, fine, I went with this guy. And so, but then once I was sober, I was like, oh my gosh, I love this guy and meet him so much. And you know what I'm saying? So I, I I started getting used to the fact that okay, I can avoid my problems go And you mm -hmm. know, how old were you when you first started? When I first started, I was 21. Yeah, I was 21. I don't remember very well. It was 2010. I'll never forget it. I'll never forget it. It was 2010. Tell me um, about it. I was 89. Mm. So, yeah, I got 2010. I was 21. 
and then I got the um get the 18th of September. That's when me and this guy broke up. Wow, and then that's when um I, I went out to the club for the friend of mine and then like people are there, like I'm Which club? Um okay, like I go East Lane. So when I lay um this place called Matanyo Lasso. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So go her name and stuff when I drag the one to be busy belly. So I will lay her picture that Obviously, I was taking anything that night. And so it turned out that my poison would be drugs over alcohol. Marakile more intention. And then, like, um, I, I, I started drugs as, as, as if it was a joke. Like, you know. I'll never be an addict, like you know, I can never be an addict because obviously what would be TV I will learn, I go school on my room, or I will eat right side in a key here, they go to one or side. So then Karawal and now no hurry and got like about addict. But then little did I know that if you uh, pointing a finger at someone, then you get three seven fingers pointing back at you. So then there was I I was there smoking with each other and then hiding where I was like living a double life and so yeah he can tell me like I'm this type of person like he can go hide and I'm this type of person trying to hide from my mom who I really am However, then right the sharp it came to extend that it got out of control wow because it was like 2010 and uh, I matriculated God 2007. Wow. So God 2010, I was doing my last year of teaching, and then I was feeling like, okay, I'm there, here I am. No, can I go? No, go TNC. No, I did office administration. Wow. Reason for your office administration, maga. That's how you mainly affect your horn kina wana hai. And now after me trick the police la, I kina go ya school long really. Wow, but and because she's a strong woman and she will get what she wants. Wants <laughs> her and then like kina wana hai like I feel like it's only normal that I'll be obedient to her as well. Wow, mm. so kano ra we think kina kina nyaka koso egi zongo la loma. Because like la loma nka do chali klasi nyana or e nge henga no or kano revise anya ne di tlo bo wow, but. I didn't want a, a, a course to eat on Teresa stress or anything like that. So our work is office administration. You know, you hear the shop. I have to go last year. Yo, can I just like start to feel like I'm Yeah, I just don't like the shop. I'm just like, no, keep the school on, keep the teacher. Life is easy. Yeah, but I'm just gonna apply and just get a job, just like that. But then. I can go on a monkey, Toma, get Toma, who too. Wabon, so who to buy Hawaii distraction more focusing ya, Gayo Horki Gray employment. Because I, um, post Colombo never tapis a whole, okay, if you go to school and you do your course and you pass, after passing, you get a job. I get never tapis a so, but they, they didn't explain your hurry. Um, you have to apply and you're gonna get many disappointments and then after many disappointments you know you mustn't give up you should, you should just carry on apply they made it sound very easy in karo kram mereko ono tsa wande ono tsa hako heno wapara diya paro hofu tata waisa cv but oh sister i wana una the qualifications are you high and then i come home so um nani ginaga because Gila school, obviously, in America, go to school, and then they can go apply just any other job. So, Nigella did post it and like it in school. But little did I know that um, experience is important as well. <laughs> so, because I had no experience, I, I had a very tough time even getting a call back, just, just an interview. So, I it came to a point where. Uh, um, I lose focus because then, like, and I'm using who apply to get money to smoke as well. So, if a little horring, 
que no habla la maga que me quedé interview que apela y que era en Cuba no hay nada que ahí te lo hago es que tú has dado que has tapa que que has tapa es que fue tu tapa muy que el caco no que los ni man que fue tapa que chila ni el da que fue tu chila ni el da que tú vive en petit lo que hay carina con que vuela hay vamos so a o que es una mujer se creen que me recoja también and then um why la hala hore my mom felt that because Gila's go long and I did everything, I'm far a little bit of independence. Wow. And she offered her okay fines to make it. I was really afraid to go to the pool. For Okonova, how she did it, she did it. Because then. Was this after you completed? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okonova, how she did it, she did it. And then, eh. Uh, Maybe then an opportunity would would come would come out there. Ah, hands on like this, that's how we get it. Hmm. It goes that thing, day and night. For young America, as young people, we're not just in the TV one. And we come every day. We study, 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 I guess my character, you know, I'm like a, one of those good girls come back. And you know good girls come back, they're always attracted to bad guys, you know, like to those rough ones. Yeah, to those three, to those three guys. So like every guy that I met, you know, was a curse from that one thing. <laughs> the one that I love so much. So every guy that I met was like somehow involved with drugs, you know. And then, um... But then, nah, I want to I to go to Satoma. I want to I'm on drugs. So I'm hiding from them that now I'm on drugs. But then, they're not hiding from me. I want to 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 an extent that then I say I must that I must not hide because we're both in the same boat. I want let's do this thing together. I want to let me do it together. You know? Was it the same one? The the same drug? Yeah, it was the same drive. It was the same drive because um, why the birds of the same feathers flock together? I don't know. You know, you know, but it just so happened that it was the same drive. Oh. And then, uh, to such an extent, yeah, hurry. Um, I couldn't pay rent because I smoked it all. And then uh, this guy that I was dating, gonna go learn some other problem. So then we get kicked out. Now, as we get kicked out, like the guy is from Limpopo, and then Lena Uti is going to go to school, Lena Kopani to school. So Lena, he's using. Mara mama hae o awe, hori ame is using. Nam maga awe, wawan. So nam maga o sam maintain o ko habo ba mu shatule awe, wawan. So yenu nanti to to go. Kamuti ya, kam kamuti ya, ko zake ro mo na mo zake ro na le soft spot for mo to. Kamuti ya kana mo mo zake na kina le pleke. Ito to na le na wa ba mo zake wa ram na magom kila lantho mo lo mo. You don't have to pay rent, you don't have to buy food. One time, just as long as we smoking, I will cool. So hebar ko ba mo um hebar ko ba mo the guy wa mo zare. Na I know a place ko mo mi loji puri hostel ko ali you know. People are not paying rent, <laughs> so there's no need for you to worry. And just as long as your mom doesn't find out, you know, it won't hurt. It won't hurt because when I know our rapa de la and we out on the street, and then um, so ratamu. Can you imagine? <laughs> Can you imagine ratamu? With, with furniture, <laughs> my God, like it's, and I still get reminded of that story, like every time, like I get all when I'm talking, talking about, I want, 